Hey YouTube, it's Maria from The Nurse Lounge. And today we're gonna to do something different. People have asked me time and time again about my scrubs and my shoes and what types of things do I wear when it comes to me being a nurse on the floor. As most of you know, I am about to um, head out of bedside into full-time academia. And even still, we still have to wear scrubs because we go to clinicals with our students. And so even still, I wanna show you what scrubs did I happen to love to wear and what shoes I happen to love to wear. Uh, this video is going to be relatively short because I'm only going to show you one scrub set. I'm going to show it to you on and do a try on, so to speak, of that um, scrub set so you can see what it looks like on me. But I'm going to show it to you first and then after that I'm going to show you the shoes and then I will show you the whole thing put together. So if you want to see what I happen to like to wear when it comes to my scrubs when I go to work, either at the hospital or for clinicals with my students, stay tuned. Where my girls at? It's going down. jump right on in I have um, you know when I first became a nurse which was back in 2004 I was into all kinds of scrubs the colors the, the tight fitted the flare leg the whatever you name it I was into that kind of scrub set um, but now that I've gotten older in nursing and if you've seen my videos you have noticed that we have to wear navy blue scrubs at the hospital so um, at that hospital RNs wear navy blue so, and I'm PRN, so being PRN, I don't work as often as someone who works full time. So I just have one or two scrub sets that are in navy blue, actually just one that I wear all the time and I just rewash it every time because I only work maybe three times every six, every six weeks. So I happen to love this brand and this is a brand new set that I have here. It is in black, um, but it's by Cherokee, Cherokee. And it's the Cherokee um, Statement four-way stretch easy care comfort and I have it in black this time it's a, it's a size large I've recently lost some weight and so now I've went from a size um, extra large to a large and I picked up this black one and this is just the um, this is what the tag looks like if you want to see well the statement right here by Cherokee and I love this line it looks luxury as you can see it has the rose gold um zipper here um it looks luxury and it is pretty expensive it's about 50 dollars, depending on where you get it 50 dollars per piece this is just the jacket and the pants okay so i like this set because for one reason well let's start with the jacket first off the hanger the jacket is very very cute as you can see it's um the material is well, what is the material? Is this four-way stretch, which it does stretch some, but you definitely need to get your typical size. It's 76 polyester, 19% rayon, and 5% spandex is what this says. So this is what it looks like right here. This is what the material looks like up close. I like this because for one, now that I've gotten older, I don't wanna have to iron. I don't wanna have to iron my scrubs. So basically what I do, it has this like side panel right here to help cinch you in and it stretches as well, as you can see, it stretches. And I happen to like this because of the fact that I don't have to iron it. So basically this is one of my dryer scrubs. So if I definitely, if I get them and I put them on my hanger immediately after I wash them or dry them, then I'm fine. But let's just say I let them sit around for a little while. If I let them sit around for a little while and they get wrinkled, all I do is put it in the dryer for wrinkle release for like 20 minutes. The wrinkles are gone and I'm good to go. I love not having to iron um, scrubs. I'm so past that. And I was someone or I am someone when I was ironing scrubs that would literally iron and have creases in my scrubs. I'm that kind of nurse, okay? So anyway, this is what the jacket looks like right here. And then the pants are so cute. So this is what the pants look like. So you have your waist with the tie. You have your same uh, rose gold pocket. It is a functional pocket. You can put your hands in it as such. And it has a cargo pocket here on the side. 
and it does have it has little stretch and this is what the bottom hem looks like it's a straight leg basically straight well let's see if i can get it together straight leg hem the back looks like this has your two pockets in the back and let's see i think these are for decoration nope they actually are functional pockets too they actually are functional pockets so this is my brand right here again this is cherokee statement and again it costs about 50 dollars per um, piece but 45 dollars per piece but for me it's definitely worth it um, i feel polished and put together when i wear this um again Blue is what we wear in the hospital because we are supposed to wear navy blue, being RNs. However, now that I'm about to go into bedside, not bedside, to academia, I can wear whatever color I want to. And a, a nice, strong black set is gorgeous, okay? All right, so now that we've looked at the scrubs, let's look at my shoes, okay? I just purchased some shoes, and you've probably already seen my shoe haul that I did. Um, but I purchased some shoes and these are my nike air max 270s that i wear to uh, work i haven't worn them yet to work but um i want to do this video before i start wearing them i wear another pair right now um but this is what they look like right here and this is just basically the air max 270s what they look like i happen to love this type of shoe this bubble right here is very supportive to me this is a running shoe i always get running shoes when it comes to me working and that's only because of the fact that um they provide great support great ankle support i do have uh flat arches so running shoes with a supportive arch is always good for me when it comes to and i'm flat footed when it comes to me working in the hospital setting so i happen to love that and again simple shoe 150 at finish line I love this shoe basic shoe goes with my outfit and here next we're about to go ahead and um, see what it looks like on before we go though I'm gonna wear this little tank top right here now mind you this is something I would not wear to work obviously but for the sake of the video the, the real the real focus is the uniform itself or the scrubs itself not what I wear underneath typically I think it's in the laundry at the moment typically if you've seen my videos I wear a white um, usually a long sleeve white shirt um, a white uh, crew neck style shirt underneath my scrub tops. Um, I typically just wear the jacket, my pants, and a shirt. I don't wear a scrub like top typically. Um, I may go back and invest in a scrub top with this outfit for when it is summertime or when I don't want to wear the jacket. But for the most part, I just wear those three pieces all the time. I'm just pretty polished and pretty straightforward when it comes to that. And so anyway, I'm going to try these on. But again, for the sake of the video, I'm just going to leave this tank top on. Uh, just to make it easier to change. I'll be right back. All right, so we are back. This is what it looks like up top, mind you. Again, I just have that same little tank top on, but I'm going to actually take it down so you can see the entire outfit. But I just want to kind of give you a little glimpse about how it looks right here. I happen to love black. Black makes you look sleek and slim anyway. So this is what it looks like up top Again, it does have the pockets but we're gonna go ahead and take it down so you can see again this is what the bottom looks like so it looks like from the back and from the other side So I'm back and hopefully you enjoyed that video. Again, I just wanted to show you real quick what I typically wear when it comes to my scrubs. I am very particular when it comes to scrubs. I have to be comfortable. I'm beyond trying to be just cute. Now, mind you, I got to be cute. You know, I have to be, I have to represent at the hospital or, or at clinicals or whatever school I'm representing. I have to be cute, but at the same time, I have to be comfortable. Comfort is more important for me today now that I'm in my 40s and that I've been on the floor for 16 years than any style that's out there. I don't need anything that's going to show my bottom. I don't need anything. This matter of fact, let me show you how high these come up in the back. So, as you can see, they come up pretty high in the back. And you know we have to stoop a lot and bend over a lot when we do our uh, getting emptying our foley's or trying to help patients up or whatever we need to do. 
So it's important for me to have scrubs that come all the way up that cover your, your bottom. So when you stoop down that you can be still covered and you're not showing your tail to everybody. So that's very important to me, but I want to show y'all that I didn't show y'all that earlier that that is one of my criteria that it comes up high enough that it stays up that again, it doesn't roll down. So for instance, I can move about and this does not roll down. Um, this is adjustable. So therefore I can let it out if I need to, but I did not need to. These bottoms are also in a size large. Um, so the top and bottom of the jacket and bottom is a size large that I have on. But yes, definitely, 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 definitely get you some of these if you happen to like and want to invest in scrubs. Now, mind you, if you're a new nurse and you're not really ready to invest in scrubs and you need to get you a pair that costs, say, $30 per pair, get you what you can afford. But as time goes on, you're going to realize it's going to be quality versus quantity. So for me, I have, you know, two or three scrub sets, but I actually can wear them and wear them and wear them, wash them, wash them, wash them, and they hold up. I do invest in my scrubs and I do invest in my shoes. Your shoes protect your feet, protect your back, your, your feet, your ankles, your arches and everything when you're working on that floor. So make sure you invest in those types of things. Invest in good scrubs, quality scrubs. That's not going to tear up. You need to buy scrubs every other, you know, every two to three months. Um, I've worn the same scrubs um, for the past three years. The ones I wear to work, the blue ones I've worn for the past three years and they're fine they're besides the fact that um they're too big and i need to really buy another size they're fine so i love this brand again this is the cherokee statement brand and so again i plan on buying another color in this again this says contemporary and it's in the color black size large as you can see right here and um i'm just gonna check it actually i purchased these on amazon so you just type in cherokee statement and amazon and you can definitely get them there, but obviously you can purchase them on Cherokee website or wherever at your local uniform um, scrub shop. So that concludes this video. Um, I've been trying to do this video for over a year now. So anyway, thank you for watching this video. Follow me on IG. The handle will be somewhere on the screen. Definitely, definitely, definitely subscribe, comment, like, share. And as usual, let's check in the comments. What scrubs do you like to wear? Show me, tell me some scrubs that I should try out. I would love to try out some new scrubs, quality scrubs, mind you, that you all happen to like, um, that you feel that it endures the test of time, that it washes well, and requires very little ironing, because I am not trying to iron. I just want to throw it in the washroom or enjoy the, throw it in the dryer and put recoil release and come out and put my scrubs on and walk out the door. That's all I want to do. So if I got to scrub, if I got to iron them, I don't really want them. All right. Until the next time, I'll see you all in the next video. Take care. Bye-bye.